Hello everybody. Today we'll be learning how to connect the Wemo Maker to your sprinkler system so you can turn them off and on or set schedules right from your smartphone. But first you'll need to download the free Wemo app if you haven't already and then set up the Wemo Maker following the instructions that came in the box. You're also going to need a few simple tools to get this project going. You're going to need a Phillips head screwdriver, the not a tool but the AC transformer, the 24 volt AC transformer that came with the controller, wire strippers, and a wire nut. You're also going to need to have the existing solenoids that are controlling the zones, and a Wi-Fi router, and of course the Wemo Maker. So what you won't need is a controller. All right, so let's get started. First thing you need to do is you're going to have to, if there's any connectors on your 24 volt AC transformer, you're going to have to cut it off. And then you'll have two remaining wires here. You're going to take each wire and strip it one quarter of an inch. Okay, and then twist them so that they have a nice contact. All right, and then you're going to take a look at your solenoid. There's two wires coming from your solenoid as well. And if you haven't done so already, you need to make sure that they have been stripped one quarter of an inch as well. I find that it helps that if you strip a little bit more on the side that will be connected to the wire nut, it allows you to twist them better together. However, we're going to keep them at a quarter of an inch for this demonstration. Okay, so now we're going to take one wire from the AC transformer and one wire from your solenoid, and we're going to twist them together. Okay, and then we're going to take the wire nut and we're going to screw it on top of that pair so we have a nice contact. Okay, then we're going to take a look at the Wemo Maker. On the back side you'll notice there's a terminal block called Relay. Okay, so there's two open terminals on here. So you're going to take one of the remaining wires, the one that's coming from the AC transformer, and put it on either side. The terminal doesn't matter. So once you get it inside the terminal, take your Phillips head screwdriver, tighten that down. All right, now you're going to take the remaining wire from the solenoid. You're going to push that in. I'll probably have to strip this a little bit more. Make that nice. Okay. Put that in there, just like that. Then we're going to screw that down. And we're done. It's that easy. All right, remember you can do more than just turn your sprinkler on and off with Wemo Maker. You can also set schedules right from your smartphone or program your sprinklers to turn off when rain is in the forecast. You can even add a moisture sensor, such as this one here, to detect whether or not your plants need watering. Goes in here, the other end connects to the remaining port on the Wemo Maker that's the sensor port. For all the other things you could do with Wemo Maker, and other products with Wemo, you can go to wemothat.com.